Hey guys, Nakarama here, and welcome back to Don't Escape 4 Days to Survive. So, we are going to start the Awakening mode. Oh, this is going to be so... Mm. Wake up, David. You have to wake up. You have to escape. Yes! Let's do this. I have actually no idea. Are the... Uh, the threads going to be the exactly same like before? Oh, just dot dot dot. Yeah, oh! Oh! Because he remembers! So, is it going to be the same threat? Wait, no, those are the locusts. Where, wait, were the locusts also the one that I had? What a nightmare. It all felt so real. I feel there was something more in that dream. Something sad and important. Why do I feel like this already happened? Yet something is different. I'm gonna find out what. Alright. Because we know already the, the basics and everything, so I'm going to speed through this a little bit. I think my nightmare might have been more than just a dream. I still have a couple of hours, but I have to find a shelter fast. Let's go. It's so weird that I'm actually now just replaying it. I don't have time to walk around this wall. There has to be a faster way to the other side, yeah. When you find a hiding place and prepare it for the night... Yep, yeah, alright. Give me this. Open that. Give me the hammerhead. Kaboom! Raboom! Raboom! Alright. So we need to drop it. And run for it, David! Run! That will take almost an hour. Bum 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 bum. Armor Game Studios presents. Gosh, I'm actually feeling like I'm doing a deja vu here right now. A game by Script Welder. Don't escape. Four days to survive. <laughs> yeah. Well, this place looks promising. Alright, need to go back to the... Well, I need to go to the back of the shed. Grab this one. Clean out here. Alright, for this I need to duct tape. I need to fix up the car again. And apparently there is going to be um, some, inf some importance for me in night three. Or day three, d depending on how you want to see it. This place looks abandoned. Staying here might be a good idea, but I only have a few hours to convert this rune into a fortress before my nightmare catches up with me. Alright, here we have a broken hammer. We actually will need that. Let's get the keys. Uh, stairs, um... Papers I don't need right now. 
All right. Let's do this. Mm, I'm first going to go to the destroyed bridge. Break off the handle. Thank you. Now we have a new hammer. Go to the other side. Going over to the other side. Moving on to the next place. Give me that. Give me the rifle. No, 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 not the money. Mm. I want the prying bar. All right, so against the locusts. Um, I need to play. I need the plastic rep again. All right, and now I'm fully loaded. I don't have the wrench yet, so I need to head back now. Um, onwards back. I guess I should prepare them already up here by hanging them up at least. Oh, no, wait, 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 wait. No! Don't go to the bathtub. There we go. This all should be now much easier for me because, I mean, I do now know at least how to do a lot. A lot of these things a bit easier. So. Um. Oh yeah, right, I need to first check also out how... What do I need for the car? A uh, car, the wheel, uh, uh, well, a tire, a uh, spark plug, I guess, and... Well, wheel, ignition coil, and fuel. Alright, alright. So next we're heading over to the blockage, or the blockade. Is this to get ourselves our hands on th our trust with a wrench? Hey, there you are back, wrenchy. Let's hope it will be more useful to me than it was to them. There is a small leaflet. Give me. Nope. That didn't help me. Strange remote controller. Perfect. Okay, so this time we have this bug. I actually don't remember. Was that actually what was in my first uh, episode? I don't remember. Ooh, you're not going to stay locked for long. Yay, my duct tape! me that okay and there I n just need to find out which bug I am uh, but I am yeah which bug I have <laughs> okay so he has bent uh, legs bent uh, bent to the back and then forward fairly slim body normal pincers I would guess I call them and a normal sized head so Um, it can only be the 420, because it, it looks fairly close, because these two it can't be. And this one has the big wings, same like the, the one that I'm carrying with me. It has also the big wings, so 420. Uh, 
Um, the label says Sonic Repellent uh, Device. Oh, wait, 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 wait. First dropping. Here we go. So we need 420. There we go. Exit. And I'll pick that one up again. Perfect. Um... How heavy am I right now? That's one kilo, but... That means I can fill the canister and bring it home. But I'm not going to do that right now. I'm actually going in here. I'm going to hang up the last uh, plastic wrap. Give me the last one. Up we go. So now... Duct tape. The trustworthy duct tape, which always solves my issues. Because seriously, the duct tape just is so good in this game. Specifically, it never runs out. For some reason. Alright, so I do not need the ladder anymore. I need to put these two pesticide things into the into the sprinklers. I don't need the money right now. I do need the wrench. I do need the crowbar. I don't need the controller. I don't need the bug. So let's now use the key here. I'm just going to drop now this one here so that it's set up. All the way to the back. I will need to actually prepare some... Some nails then. Okay, so first of all... Duct tape, sealing the holes. Bam. And bam. It seems to be dead. Uh, power the generator first. Then needs to be set to the water pumps. I can't then put it on because it doesn't have fuel. Um, is there anything in the cargo box? No, there isn't. So we can move on. Uh, let's tear down actually these. One time. Second, whoops. Second, because we need two times to create an entire bridge. So first to the broken bridge. Let's use it on here so we get the tire. Now we use the hammer on the planks. Sure, I can do that. Two hours. Uh... Yeah, come on. Let's do it. We need to be done with that. So now we don't waste time at least anymore. Now I can get fuel. Oh, I need to take an extra detour. I need to go back to the to the wrecked car near the blockade, uh, blockade, because then I can get the ignition coil. All right. 
Let's go back over here. 40 minutes. All right. All right. Car. I have to take a few. Yeah, sure. I have that time. The car is busted, so it's not going anywhere. One part uh, that seems to be fine is the ignition coil. Sure. Let's get the ignition coil. Well, let's see. 45 minutes. Two minutes. Uh, two hours left. Fine. That's going to be totally fine. I hope. I might actually not be able to get the the car running. Mm. Let's actually see. Wait. Ignition coil. 15 minutes. Okay. I've installed a part. Um, the tire. Takes another 15 minutes. Alright. Let's fuel the car. Whoops. Let's fuel... Hey! Let's fuel the car. Get back in. Drive over here. So this time we're only taking 6 minutes. What is good. And... Filling! I don't know, I guess we don't need anything from here right now. So let's head back to the beginner house. Let's fuel the generator. Come on. Start, damn it. There we go. Now we need to fix this one. What is going to probably be my biggest issue again. Oh boy. There we go. Aha. Maximum efficiency. All right, it's been a while since I've written anything here. The world is dead, so they say. So why even bother? I think the moon, what's left of it, is getting bigger every day. I had a I had a weird dream last night. It felt surreal. I was attacked by a swarm of giant bugs or locusts. I don't know. All I know is that it was painful as hell. When they stripped the meat off my bones. This morning I saw something that looked like a dark cloud in the ho on the horizon. I know it's not really a cloud. The swarm is coming. Uh, I have to find a place to hide. I found an abandoned house that looks like a good place to stay. I have a hunting rifle and some bullets. Not a perfect weapon against these bastards, but it will probably help. I installed plastic wrap in all of the windows. I put out a sonic repellent device. It should scare off some insects. Let's just hope I configured it to the right sound frequency. I scheduled the water sprinklers to put out a wall of mist with some extra pesticide solution. I can... Uh, can I improve my chances somehow? Um... I don't know... No, I don't think there was anything more. Wait. No. Yeah? Oh yes, that might actually help me! Uh, I, I need to move again. I still got time. That's, that's good. That might actually help me. 
fill the canister. Give me fuel, give me fire, give me that what I desire. Yeah! Because if I take this and go back home, I can take the sprue crap. I forgot something. And back to the, the gas station. There's a lighter. Give me that. All right. I've poured fuel into it. And now I have a flamethrower. That must help. A flamethrower against these little... Bugs. I don't know what you actually thought I would going I would be able to say right now, but gosh dang it. Cause that should actually help a lot. Let's go to the front. Of course, close the door. Lock it. Uh, this door back here was already locked, right? Yep. All right. So, um, the gas canister is full. All is done. I guess that's all I can do for this night. So, first, let me save. So here we go, day one again. Just this time, it's the awakening! Yeah! So, let's try it then out. I built a makeshift flamethrower, might come in handy in case they get inside the house. Can I improve my chances somehow? <laughs> Take the flamethrower! The evening sky darkened as a block bleh, as a black cloud of uh, of the swarm arrived. You found a hiding place in an abandoned farmhouse. An automated sprinkler system kicked in as the swarm was getting near. Despite being old and faulty, the sprinklers worked perfectly, fully covering the air above the fields with a dense mist. As a result, 32 insects were stopped by the sprinklers. The water was saturated with strong pesticides from the incoming sw For the incoming swarm, it was a deadly wall of poisonous mist. The pesticide was kill has killed 48 insects. You deployed the sonic repellent uh, device to fend off some of the insects. It was placed near your hideout, so the signal was strong. The device seemed to be set to the correct frequency, fending off 50 the front door was closed, keeping all, away all of the 14 locusts that would have entered through it. The back door was closed, keeping away all of the 14 locusts that would have entered through it. The window on the top floor, uh, on the ground floor, was covered with plastic wrap. The foil was attached to the frame with a lot of duct tape. Out of 14 insects that tried to enter the house, in the house through that window 14 were stopped yeah the window on the upper floor was covered with plastic wrap so another 14 were stopped and here comes the next one yes perfection death infestation that's all of them you fended off all of the insects before they even entered the house. You w went to bed early and had a well-deserved rest, allowing you to regain some strength. Plus five kilogram and permanent carry weight. Yes! Yeah! Hi, Kate! <laughs> Yo, stick the landing! Alright, so what's going to kill us this time? Is it the cold again? Oh, no, it's heat. 
Ooh. How do I defend myself against heat? I don't know. Whee! Bunk, bunk. <laughs> what was that? The attic? Alright, but sadly, this is all the time that I have for this episode. I'm sorry if I'm rushing this kind of stuff, but I'm so excited to see how this game truly ends. So, for now, thank you all so much for watching. If you liked it, then leave back a like and a comment and tell me what you thought about it. And if you want to see more stuff like from me, then click the subscribe button on my channel, either on my channel, better said, or down below. And uh, click the bell icon to always be up to date. As per usual, I hope I see you guys in the next video. Till then, see ya!